Yo, what is going on, everyone? Welcome back to the Zen Lounge. In this video, I'm going to be discussing a new feature coming to the XRP Ledger. Browser extension wallets are coming to the XRP Ledger. In this video, I'm also going to be discussing XRP Vegas. I'm going to be sharing who's going to be presenting. Solo Jank is going to be presenting. Uphold's going to be there. We'll discuss that in a moment. First, Ripple X just hosted an Ask Me Anything with the Crossmark team. And they're the ones building a new browser extension wallet on the XRP Ledger. If you don't know what a browser extension wallet is, uh, the most popular wallet on Ethereum is MetaMask, and that's a browser extension wallet. And that's going to be coming to the XRP Ledger. So the host asks the Crossmark team to quickly describe what Crossmark is and what motivated them to build it. So Crossmark is a browser-first digital wallet built on top of the XRP Ledger, supporting most of the native features and transaction types on the Ledger. You'll be able to install the wallet on your browser, like your Chrome, Firefox, etc. It will very much look and feel like a combination of Zum and MetaMask. He was motivated to build Crossmark because as he was developing on the XRP Ledger, he was looking for something to make it easier to sign transactions and to switch between networks. For the longest time, funding test wallets on the parallel networks was not easy using Zum Wallet. Crossmark will make this easier and hopefully serve as a good resource for new developers like himself building on the XRP Ledger. So that's very exciting. I'm a big fan of browser extension wallets. Um, and also, I want to show one other key point from this article is that the coder, the, the developer, has been looking into the new proposals coming to the XRP Ledger, like XLS38D the sidechain amendment and XLS 30, the automated market making amendment. And he's very excited. He's saying the same things that we've been saying. These are very, very well thought out features. And he looks forward to the liquidity they will bring to the XRP ledger. So he thinks that this is going to help liquidity also. So if you would like to read this for this, the full ask me anything, what I'm going to do is leave this in the description below. Let's quickly look through their website. So Crossmark, unleashing interactive money. It is coming soon. Um, it's a new digital wallet, unleashing interactive money, built for the masses, coming to the XRP ledger. You could join the beta, beta and uh, it's fairly new. So now moving on, uh, if you're part of the Solidank newsletter, you would receive email updates about what's coming to the ecosystem. And there's going to be a panel. There's going to be a panel discussion, XRP Vegas. Actually, let me switch forward. So there is a sold out event. I think there's actually a few tickets left. Uh, digital at, digital Perspectives put together an XRP Army event in Las Vegas. It's happening this weekend. And a uh, bunch of people are coming to town for it. So you could see here's XRP Vegas. It's going to be a packed house, sold out crowd. We got Jack McDonald. CEO of PolySign, Nancy Beaton, one of the top 25 international women's in crypto, also the Uphold Chief Revenue Officer, the COO of Link2. We have Fabio from Sologenic attending. We have Eleanor, from a journalist from Fox. They're all going to be in Vegas. John Beaton. Uh, Jeremy Hogan. A bunch of big names. Roy, a community director at Link2. And then we also have uh, another guy from, from Uphold, the CEO of Uphold, Robin O'Connell. Then that's everybody. And the panel is going to be a discussion on bringing asset tokenization to new mar markets. Fabio is presenting with Nancy Beaton of Uphold. Uh, the Sologenic team prepares to take on XRP Las Vegas from May 5th to the 6th. This event will be filled with key figures in the space. I just showed you the key figures and talented individuals who are dedicated to expanding the XRP ecosystem. Representing Sologenic will be Fabio, head of growth and partnerships, who will be on the panel speaking about tokenization alongside Nancy Beaton from Uphold and other industry leaders. Here's the flyer. So if you're coming to XRP Vegas, let me know in the comment section below if you're going to XRP Vegas. Sologenic right now is the number one token on the XRP ledger and it's been getting listed on multiple exchanges recently. A new one is Changely. Solo was listed on Changely. So that's a new exchange. 
Corium, there's a hackathon being held right now, and they're hosting a workshop for people that want to learn, have an introduction to Corium's architecture, main features, and use cases. I was just posted today. So a quick Corium update. So now I'm going to get into something really, really juicy. <laughs> so we know that Ripple has offices in UAE. UAE is very friendly to uh, crypto. And just the other day, BitOasis, this was yesterday, becomes the first to secure a broker dealer license for Dubai's virtual asset authority. This is exactly what Sologenic applied for to be um, for their pilot program that's supposed to launch uh, Q2, Q3 for uh, tokenizing the UAE as a pilot. A centralized exchange just secured it and was the first person to secure it. So centralized exchanges are probably a lot easier than a decentralized exchange. So BitOasis, a cryptocurrency trading platform in the Middle East and North Africa, has secured a license to provide broker-dealer services in Dubai. Uh, all from the Virtual Asset Regulatory Authority in Dubai. So it's an MVP license. will also help BitOasis launch strategic partnerships in the UAE by qualified investors, the opportunity to buy, sell, and hold virtual assets on the platform and launch new virtual asset products with continued focus on driving accessibility, consumer protection, and utility across the virtual asset ecosystem. So this is the first that was given, and we know BitOasis has been close with Ripple for a very long time. First of all, they've listed Ripple and XRP for years now. But here's the key thing I looked up, is Ripple's regional... Uh, they've been three years ago. Ripple had a panel talking about the regulatory climate in the UAE with the CEO, this lady right here. Let me show you a picture up close. An update on regulatory climate in the UAE. Ola Dowden, co founder of BitOasis, connects to Ripple. She is very proud to be the first platform to receive VARA's MVP operational license last week. This is an important milestone for BitOasis, Dubai, and the growing UAE eco crypto ecosystem. Watch my last video on Sologenic I made a couple of days ago talking about the roadmap and how UAE is part of the roadmap. Ripple is also very... Um, they have offices in, in Dubai as well. But that Vara, like the Vara license, is exactly what Otto Nino was mentioning here that they're applying for. So he mentions the Vara here back 3 8, 2023. So I brought that up right here. So there's a lot of dots that are connecting here. Uh, eyes on the UAE. You know, Ripple has lots of connections there, Sologenic has lots of connections there. And, um, yeah, guys, this is my update for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Again, let me know who's coming to XRP Vegas. And remember, this isn't financial advice. This is us researching the XRP ledger. Have an awesome day. Peace.